Good evening, ladies and gentlemen, brothers and sisters. My name is Nizam, and here we are going to talk about my republic. Okay. Just for information, if you have any um, electrical device, please uh, put it on silent mode. If you need to really take the phone call, you can just step outside, not a problem at all. What we're going to be talking about is to introduce who we are and our resident, residential and business offering. Take a seat, sir. Right. Okay, settle down, sorry. Okay. Now, and then we are going to talk about the MPP program, My Republic Partner Program. Okay. And then after that, we will have a 15 minute break to get to know your partner managers. Just mingle around. And career and compensation review. Last but not least, the sales and admin support. Okay. Now, why you are here is I think some of you got in from the career fair. Come to know us from the career fair. Now, a lot of. Um, a lot of people actually came to know us from word of mouth referral. Okay, now this is the the big the biggest thing about my Republic Partner Program, how we operate, and and it's going to get much much more interesting from here. Okay, but I'm just going to skip to the most important part here, which is to understand what my Republic is offering. Why my Republic? Why not other ISP? Why my Republic? Why now? Right? Now let's take a look. My Republic offers internet. Okay, we are one of the internet service providers in Singapore. So what we what we have here is fiber. Okay, so we are also associated with the Next Generation National Broadband Network, or otherwise known as the NGN network. Okay, now who are this NGN network? Basically, in Singapore, the one that controls the opponent, uh, the fiber, are the opponent. Okay, and then comes all the active network, all the uh, ISP, internet service providers like uh, maybe Singtel, Stop, M1, um, ViewQuest, Super Internet, and then My Republic, and of course the retail services that you can see many operators are uh, having. Right now, who is My Republic? Who is the one behind My Republic? Okay, as you can see, the first guy here. These are the three main ones. Okay, Malcolm Rodriguez, CEO and co-founder. He was also um, Responsible for the Nucleus Connect, Singapore's NBN operator. He launched Tahub um, Singapore, 360 network in Hong Kong. And he's also for, former chairman of Singapore Internet Exchange. Not Stock Exchange, not SGX, eh? SGIX. <laughs> I, at first I thought it was SGX. Okay? And then we have Greg Midman, who is a VP and also co founder. He's the man behind Alcatel Lucent. And he's also co founder of Multi Channel Communication, which is sold for $40 million. Last but not least, we have Mr. Casey Lai, who is the CEO and co-founder as well. He is the CCO of M Phone in Cambodia. He also launched Tahub as SVP of Consumer Sales, and he also played a senior management management role in M One. So, looking at their profile, their background, you will realize that these people they know what they are talking about. You know, these are the people who are involved in telco, and here we are in um, My Republic, formed by these three guys. Okay, now. Here's our opportunity. When we're talking about um, capturing the Asia Pacific market, okay, how our approach is to go through with this fiber, okay, and then if you realize, this is the projection in 2015, okay, the fiber broadband market size that we are uh, projecting to capture is about more than one million addressable market in Singapore, okay, more than 7.4 million addressable market across Australia, New Zealand and Malaysia, which we are already there. Okay, My Republic is already in New Zealand, in um, Australia, in Malaysia. Okay? And then fiber broadband by the year 2018 is about 16 million addressable market across this region. Now, our target is only 4 to 7 percent of this market share for every city that we enter. It's not too much, but it's pretty, uh, a decent amount of size uh, for every one of us to really take. Not for the smaller players, okay? Take a seat, sir. There's one in the back, no problem. Okay. So, where are we right now? Ever since the launch day, February 2012, we have more than 25,000 households and business connected. More than 3,600 um, rate of new customer acquisition per quarter, and it has always been a 99.99% uptime. I think that's more important. Quality, you know? We want to promote good internet service we want it, we want to give cheap but quality we must also uphold a 99.99% okay <coughs> 
excuse me. And then, um, just to sum up, more than 1,000 My Republic partners for this MPP. MPP, My Republic Partner Program. Okay, and more than 600 business, businesses using our service already. We are one of the fastest growing internet service provider in Singapore. And I think that one deserves a clap, don't we? Come on, give a clap for My Republic. So ever since 2012, okay? So we have one, been one of the fastest growing My Repub, uh, internet service provider. And today, 9 July, I don't know whether you all heard about this, My Republic has officially said that they want to be the fourth telco in Singapore. Okay? It is in the today's paper. Fourth telco, hopefully My Republic attracts 30 million from investors. Yeah. Today, you got today papers, huh? You have, huh? Later you can check on page 44, I guess. Okay. So, yeah. So, this is from our, our My Republic CEO. This is what he said. You can read more on this online or later you can, you know, just Google. All right. And then, fourth telco, hopefully, My Republic attracts 30 million investors from, uh, 30 million from investors. As you can see, we are in the business right now. Last time, it was only ISP. A lot of people say, uh, I'm bundled with another ISP, you know, they have this bundle, they have that bundle. Today, My Republic has taken it to the next level. We are going to be in a uh, telco soon and we can provide this service to the community of Singapore and even beyond that as well as we go further, all right? So, product offering for residential. Okay, this is a little bit more techy, okay? I wouldn't want to go in depth because it's you know you can just see but what what it says here is my republic is providing services to across um across singapore the jurong west bukit panjang exchange uh, orchard exchange Bedok exchange and many more okay i'll skip this part okay now in a nutshell my republic offers crystal clear high definition video ultra fast speed across multiple device and superior peak hour performance okay because of our one gpps plan that we offer to the public since early this year okay more of the of the uh, package or the plan is inside the booklet that you have okay so don't worry if you not sure you can always refer to that booklet again then i just want to tell you why my republic is better in my opinion because of these facts okay it's about the priority how they prioritize data okay now data prioritization for international downloads protects video streamings gaming voip and web surfing and many more okay this prevents network congestion okay somehow or other when we serve the internet when we use the internet our data is being identified. Those packets are being identified by the ISP and then it is being prioritized into different channels. So let's say it's a gaming channel, it's going to be very high priority. And then if it's video streaming or web surfing, it's going to be high and then standard will be file sharing and downloads. Now it doesn't mean if you are doing just file sharing and downloads, it's going to be standard, that means it's going to be slow. No. What we are focusing here, the point is no network congestion. Okay, if everything is all going to one channel, that's it. You know, you will feel lagging and this and that. But so far, my republic because of this, um, this priority. Okay, this is how it looks like visually. Okay, now to illustrate how data prioritization looks like. Okay, high priority is not like everyone is stuck into one channel. No, all goes through different channel. This is one good thing about my republic. No network congestion at any anything that you are doing all right so can you imagine the possibilities one gbps you know how awesome this is i know i i, I used to have 100 uh, mbps speed at home 100 at that point of time it was like wow fast you know and then you know, data gets more and more okay i feel that 100 mbps is not enough why there are like so many devices connected to my 100 mbps now can you imagine the possibilities of one gbps Okay, you could just download a 2 gig 720p HD movie in less than 3 minutes. Highest quality movie will be like a Blu-ray, 6 gig Blu-ray in less than 10 minutes. Can you imagine? Oh, that's fast, ultra fast. Okay, we are connecting others to across borders with ultra fast speed and this is what My Republic has got to offer. Alright, so... To, to carry on, the next one, the next part, I will hand over to the next partner manager who will be telling you more about what is the package like, the residential um, offerings for 
My Republic One GPPS program, okay, and whatever other requirements that you need to have before getting this thing installed at your home. All right. So please help me to welcome, okay, Mr. Vel to come forward and present. Okay, come on, give a hand, Mr. Vel. Okay. Now I will actually touch a little bit more on our product. Our product line is actually very simple. For residential, there's only two. There's only two products over here. For the okay, okay, for the one GBPS for for the home, there is the ultra one gigabyte, which is the one thousand Mbps, is going at uh, forty nine ninety nine a month. Okay, it's one thousand uh, Mbps download up to five hundred Mbps upload, video streaming priority, no bit torrent blocking, and okay, there's a fifty eight dollar service activation cost. So when you sign up, it is uh, 58, then uh, it's 49.99 a month. Okay, there's another package which is actually more for the um, gamers. So it's actually 59.99. The different, the only difference is actually okay. There is actually um, gaming priority and uh, low latency uh, customer routing. So all these people who actually play online game, they will understand what it's all about. So simple. This is the a residential uh, product and we are giving away a um, hundred dollars off your router because for routers we don't uh, provide it free at the moment there's actually three routers for you to choose from okay there's actually three router oh, I think it's not in the in the slide itself okay now plus three months not the product actually is plus three months uh, free home voice home voice you can actually uh, subscribe to a digital phone line then uh, three three months uh, teleport. Okay, I will touch a little bit more on the what is actually teleport all about later. Then plus a hundred dollars off uh, the Yoru router. That means whatever the price of the router, there will be a hundred dollars discount from uh, from this price. Okay. So Ultra One Gigabyte forty nine ninety nine per month. Okay, what gamer is uh, fifty nine ninety nine per month? Okay, up to what is what is this scheme all about? Is up to uh, two hundred dollars for all contracts. That means your contract of uh, the other telco, which is uh, going to end, we are actually paying you up to $200 for you to uh, sign the contract. You need to activate our service, then uh, you, you prove us to the cancellation and uh, the bill, the balance bill. Then we will actually credit up to $200 for your old contract. Okay, sign up for one gigabyte contract. Send us termination bill of your old contract and we credit amount up to $200. This is for people who probably left with maybe uh, within six months contract for your old uh, broadband uh, price. Okay, there's another program that we are actually giving is actually the miss the free open net TP. Same, you just sign up. Okay, you guys uh, know what is a TP point, right? Oh. For, the, for the open net. Okay, if you miss it, that means your house Either you have forget to inform OpenNet to come and install the thing, or probably when they send you the the so letter, the uh, the offer, then you you missed it. So now actually you got to pay for it. But we actually have a plan for for you for all those people who miss it. So you sign up for a one gigabyte uh, plan, then you deposit a non uh, refundable two three five point four for the TP point. That means this is actually a deposit. Then you will actually get this uh, uh, return your deposit by crediting you uh, uh, two three five point four. That means after eighteen months, uh, we return your deposit. So this is for people who actually miss the point. Then uh, we will actually act as this pro this uh, program uh, for you to install. Yeah. Then uh, during after the 13, eighteen months, uh, for the two years contract, at eighteen months, uh, we will just uh, deposit uh, back to your account. Okay. Okay, static IP. A free subscription uh, as long as you are you, you are a My Republic customer. Fifty dollar one time setup. This is for static IP. What is a static IP used for? Okay, maybe probably a lot of people they want to view the CCTV camera uh, over your iPhone or over your smart, uh, smartphone. So. For all these functions, uh, you actually need to have a static IP because normally our computer is all running on a random IP. So you need to have a static IP for, in order for the kind of function to be able to, to hook 
the, the camera to your phone. So this is, in my Republic, you actually have a free subscription, but it's only a one-time uh, $50 setup. So this is an option that we can actually go um, with your, this uh, broadband. Okay, this is the router that I'm talking about just now. So this, this price is after, okay, this actually is 169 but after the $100 voucher uh, discount, it's actually now $69. And this is the same thing, $179, and this is the Okay, this is just now what I talk about the home home voice plan. Home voice plan that means you actually have a this digital phone. Then now we actually have a basic basic plan, a plus plan and a pro plan. This is actually a free free incoming call, free outgoing call to my public line, and a free call ID, voicemail, call forwarding. It'll be. A, $49 a service installation, uh, two cents per minute for outgoing locals. Actually, what I'm sharing here will be on the this uh, portal. Everyone will have a, a personal portal after tonight, after you sign up as MPP. So all these slides actually is inside. So tonight, I'm actually just going through, so you can actually uh, go back and actually take a look at, at all these slides again if you, if you need more information, okay? So for, for the Home Voice uh, Plus plan, the same thing. Okay, unlimited local calls, 30 minutes, IDD calls for every month, uh, caller ID, call folding. Okay, same, it's actually a $49 installation. Okay, the pro plan is 1888 with a uh, different setup, 1000 minutes, this one call ID, and uh, also call folding. Okay, this is the, this is a rate. Actually, our, this uh, digital phone, the IDD rate actually is very low. So uh, people who make a lot of overseas call or pro probably people need to uh, do some uh, business overseas, this is actually very good because uh, the, the price is pretty pretty uh, cheap compared to this is a Singtel, Starhub and M1 uh, rates. And this is the <coughs> My Republic rate. And this is a saving. Okay. For, for especially for China and uh, India, maybe Vietnam, yeah. This, this is all, all the few countries, uh, the IDD rates. Hey, but how come Malaysia is not included? Uh, Malaysia is not included, yeah. Because Malaysia anyway is not, not very expensive to call Malaysia. Ma. So, so this is only more for international country. Okay. Okay, teleport. When every customer sign up with MyRepublic, the back end design is actually just teleport. Okay, people who actually surf the net, they will realize that sometimes when you go to one site, sorry, you are not from this region, you cannot view this content. This is because um, every country, they, they actually uh, sector and all these things. But what this teleport is all about, actually to summarize one thing is that it brings you to all countries. That means you want to view uh, Foray, Hulu or Netflix from US, that means to the computer, they recognize you that you are a US resident. You can, read, you can, you can view all these things. And people who like to view, uh, especially uh, now is the World Cup season, all the EPL, EPL games, play Singtel, uh, Mio, a lot of money for, for viewing. But we have uh, these uh, EPL passes. Uh, they can watch all the game live on the computer at $150 a year. A year. So one month average, you, I think you are paying maybe $50, $60 for Mio TV for the EPL games. But this one, one year, all the games you can watch. Because of this, sorry because of uh, uh, teleport services. Of course, this is, this is not going to be for free for, for long. Now, signing up uh, is free for three months, and after that, you'll be uh, 188 per month for 12 months, okay? Then the basic package, you can watch Netflix, Hulu, uh, Amazon Prime Video. Then basic enhance is, you can watch the Fox, BBC, ITV, okay, and, and, and that's actually more. That's for sports, you can actually, uh, Pre, as I mentioned to you just now, Premier League passes, this is for the EPL. Then uh, Fox Soccer 2, then uh, all this different, different uh, package uh, for drama for every people who like to Korean drama and all this. Uh, you can actually view uh, uh, unlimited through this uh, teleport. Then uh, Hong Kong, then uh, this one is actually, uh, oh, this one is actually in, in for all those Indian movies. 
Okay, this is what uh, some programs are that is offer on uh, TV, music, sports, news. Okay, this is ne Netflix. Actually, is the biggest library of movies uh, and TV on demand. Okay, that's Hulu. But of course, this one, when you already sign into it, there might be a cost, but it's still cheaper than uh, what you are paying actually for for your. Mio TV for your startup set top box because now we everyone is actually moving away from the set top box, but for all our telcos, they have uh, a lot of legacy. They have a lot of equipments to want, wanted to sell you. They cannot pull out from the market. But we we are start we are starting from fresh, and we have all these things to support us. Now, if you have a computer with a fast enough speed, you can able to see all these things uh, at a just fraction of the cost. So. The only thing that you need to do is uh, need to have is only the high-speed internet, which now we are actually providing you up to one gigabyte. One gigabyte actually can do wonders. You can actually view a lot of content uh, from the computer itself. So, okay, all this is uh, different, different uh, programs. Actually, actually, you can view from from uh, the internet. Okay, so actually, teleport support platforms and device you not just can build the teleport through your computer you actually can view it through your tablet through your uh, this uh, smartphone or even uh, or even your this uh, iPhone so you can just do some settings uh, to, to be able to to be able to view uh, all this uh, all this program on the device okay Now we touch a little bit more on our this uh, SMB plan, which is for my public. We have the residential plan, and we also have the SME plan. Okay, there's a sorry. There's actually two hundred and twenty thousand uh, SME in Singapore, and uh, twenty three thousand uh, plus uh, commercial buildings, and all covered by Singtel Copper, and eight hundred covered by uh, this uh, startup. So. SMB have had limited choice uh, in the past, but in uh, in the this um, Singapore SME broadband market, uh, it is seventy percent uh, is actually by the three telcos. Okay, only only thirty uh, percent uh, by other people. So now actually we have total of eight licenses providing this. Um, uh, internet service. So, tens of thousands of companies in Singapore are still paying uh, more than $800 a month uh, for 10 Mbps. Uh, just imagine, how, what can 10 Mbps do for you nowadays? Uh, for uh, legacy broadband, okay? But the 70% of the telcos, uh, they are actually making this money, which is $800. So, we, it's, it's a time uh, and it's also a chance uh, for us to actually give them a choice. And our our basic plan for business uh, is only hundred and forty nine dollars, less than hundred fifty dollars a month. So you can actually uh, have a very big market uh, to actually promote to them. Okay, and this is um, in the other countries. Uh, the the main telcos uh, are actually having thirty percent of the thing, and all other players uh, will have the seventy percent. So. What we are trying to do is we are trying to educate more people and also giving them more, uh, a choice uh, on uh, to, to put this thing uh, to, to be equal, to be like overseas uh, rather than Singapore. The three telcos uh, is taking this big chunk of it uh, and, and other players are only 30%. Uh, okay, so why, what My Republic offers? Fast reliable uh, broadband from 100 Mbps to 1 gigabyte. So our basic plan is 100. Um, 100, 200, 500, and up to 1,000. Okay, then uh, superior customer service. We work closely with you to ensure that all your enterprise needs are met, and the fast and smooth setting up of your connection. Okay, then customized network solution with our connection to uh, major carriers and uh, 50 peering partners. Uh, we offer network solution, specially customized to your business need. Okay, this is actually our plan. The business hundred. It's a 100 Mbps download. We have 99.95% uh, of uh, SLA. It's a SLA is actually a service uh, service agreement. Okay, 24/7 uh, technical support. 
Then the basic router, the N56, and uh, one static IP for this basic plan. And this plan is 149. Then uh, business plan is uh, business plan 200 is uh, 200 Mbps. Business plan plus is 500 Mbps. The business plan pro is 1,000 Mbps. So this is the from 150 to 1,999. This is 2,000 dollars. Okay, you can actually understand more. Uh, we actually have another training on the, the this SME training. So you can you can actually know more details uh, by attending that the training. We will go, go more in depth because SME selling and uh, residential selling is a little bit more is a little bit different because uh, you need to understand a little bit uh, what uh, business needs. Uh. So there is actually another uh, training on the business plan. Okay, marketing and uh, distribution strategy. Okay, you know in Singapore. All our telco actually spend uh, 32, 32 percent and up to 54 percent uh, of their entire annual operating budget on sales and uh, marketing. What is the typical example? Singtel. They spend how much? They spend just on uh, promoting on uh, M1 itself. Uh, sorry, F1 itself, Formula One. Uh, before that, they they are they are they are broadband service. But they actually spend between uh, up to 50 percent uh, of their annual operating budget. Just, just on uh, promoting their brand and, and throwing all the money, but okay, our marketing dollars are go directly to the people. Yeah. That is why we are here today, because we actually uh, pay all the MPPs uh, to go out and promote for us, and all the monies are actually go directly back to back to all our MPPs. So for promoting and selling our product service. Our partners uh, put that money back into the community. Okay. Okay. We are a telecommunication company that employs uh, many of the typical uh, telecommunication channel, incubant, dealers, system integrators, IT show, road show. Okay, but however, our this program, which is the MP program, will always be our main direct sales uh, partner program. So actually we, we work very closely with the company and we are actually one of the mainstream uh, income for the company. Okay, the next thing is how to sign up. I think some of the people here actually went to the job fair, so they, they actually uh, fill up the form already, right? So this is how to sign up as an MPP. Okay, next I will actually, okay. If you have more questions later, all those people uh, can actually approach, during the break time, they can actually approach anyone uh, around here, and especially also all those people in uh, the purple t-shirt is all from our MPP members. You can actually check with them. Okay, this is, this is the consultant agreement form. So after, after this, we are going to take a break of 15 minutes. So all those decided to sign up for MPP, just fill up this form. Hey, hi, okay, good evening. Okay, I'll keep it very simple and short for you. Okay, I understand that it's going to be a long night. Okay, uh, I won't cover, okay, I won't cover the commission part. Okay, but I think this is very important. Okay, the first step, okay, after you go through the product, I think you need to know how you're going to qualify a customer. Correct? Because, uh, if you know, okay, if you know the product, correct, but you don't know how to qualify a customer, it's very difficult for you to do the sales. You see, we join this, okay, MPP program is as a sales consultant, correct? If you cannot qualify customer, you are actually picking the wrong person, correct? If you want to sell software, correct, you're going to be selling software to a, a child, correct? You're going to sell to the parent, correct? It's the same thing, okay? So the first thing you have to qualify your customer, okay? This is a fiber, okay, distribution point, okay? Those that live in HTV will understand that. Oh, <laughs> you saw before, correct? Okay, this is uh, usually they are near to the leaf, correct? Near to the riser. Okay, this show that this HTV block is fiber ready, correct? But most of the time, okay, for us, okay, when we sign our new customer, okay, your friend call you, for example, correct? You, you're not going to run down to the HTV flat and then go and take a look at the staircase, whether they got this thing, this uh, fiber broadband uh, box at the staircase or not, correct? Okay, so what I do, okay, I share with you what I do, okay, is I usually go to this website called www.opennet.com.ig. Okay, opennet.com.ig okay, is a website where you can find okay, whether this unit, okay, for residential, uh, this unit be landed, condo or HTV, whether they are fiber ready or not. Correct? If they are not fiber ready, there's no point, correct? You pitch to them. Okay? So for you don't have to remember this uh, this uh, website because this one you after a while you will, you will remember it by, by heart, okay? This is how it will look like. Okay, just skip this one first. Okay. 
So the important thing about okay, fiber broadband is that you need to know okay, the basic of fiber broadband is they need to have this TP point, we call the termination point, in their house. Okay, just now what you saw, the big box is outside their house, correct? Outside, they are near the leaf, near the riser. This is inside the house, correct? This is called, in short form, we call it TP. That means termination point. Okay, this one, okay, guys, listen. Okay, this one is supplied by the open net. Okay, supplied by open net. Okay, that means if you sign up Sintel, N1, Star Hub, My Republic, whatever, they will usually supply you this first. Okay, without this, you, their premises cannot install fiber broadband. Okay? Sometimes. Correct, okay. So let me explain the very basic uh, terms in this uh, industry. Okay, it's called home pass or home reach. Okay, home pass, okay. If you all know, okay, home pass means that, okay, this house, correct, okay, is fiber ready. That means just like I explained to you, okay, the whole block, correct, is fiber ready. They have this uh, fiber uh, termination point outside the house, but inside the house, they do not have this TP point, correct? That's why it's called home pass, okay? Slowly you understand, okay. Home bridge is the same thing. They have the TP point, correct, outside the house, okay? At the same time, they have this termination point in their house. Okay, so when will your house become home rich? Do you know that? Okay, obviously it's after you sign up, correct? Okay, last time when you first start off this, when Singapore government first started this thing, anybody when they beat you, the new flat, right? Correct, okay? Uh, they, will, they will actually install this thing, correct? In, inside the house. Okay, now I, I heard it's different. Okay, that means only when you start to work, want to apply for fiber broadband, be it in the M1 Star Hub, then they will go to your house and install this termination point, okay? TP point, okay? So just remember, okay, this home pass, home bridge is as good as debit credit in, in account terms. You know, it's a very basic thing. You have to understand this in order to qualify your customer, correct? Because you will understand that home pass actually is when you need two appointments. One appointment is from OpenNet to come and install this TP point. Second appointment is from My Republic to come and install the modem, the router, okay? Home reach because they already have this thing in the house, so you need one appointment, okay? Can? So let me ask you this question, okay? So home pass or home reach, each one can they sign up for broadband? Do you know? Oh, the answer is both can sign up. Correct? It's just that the appointment is different, okay? They got two appointments, they got one appointment. This one, this one is more troublesome, that's all, okay? No problem, you'll get to know this. Okay, this is a ONT, we call it a optical network terminal. Okay, this is whereby they will link, okay, look at this diagram. They'll link this TP point, okay, all the way, okay, to this ONT and then to the router, okay? Using this uh, CAT 5E or 6 LAN cable. Okay, this is how it look like, okay? In the diagram, it will look like this. Okay, the TP point, you saw this TP point, right? This TP point, correct, it linked to the ONT, ONT linked to the router, okay? This one is a voice adapter, okay? It's only when you add on, have this add on service. I think just how well they explained to you, there's an add on service whereby if you want a digital line called Home Voice, this is the one, correct? Then you need to have a power supply, you see? So this is, uh, you have to supply your own phone, okay? We don't supply phone for you. So remember, okay, this is a TP point linked to the modem or ONT, linked to a router, and then this is Wi Fi to your laptop or to your computer. Okay, then you need two power supply. Okay, don't worry about this thing. You don't have to memorize this thing. Okay, when I first joined, I know uh, my batch, uh, they, they're very you know funny one. They're going to draw this diagram. No need, correct? Because this one will be in your extra net. Okay, you can print this out and put in your folder. So when you present to your, to your friend, to your relative, I think uh, you can actually uh, bring this out. Okay, so for the sales and admin, okay, basically I think you have this service application form, right? Do you have the sales application form? You don't have. Uh, no, do they have the sales application form? Oh, okay, never mind. Okay, sales application form, okay, service application form is when you sign up your customer, correct? You need to know how to fill out this thing. Okay, let me explain. Huh? Okay, this thing. Okay, you have a service application form and then you have a, a gyro form, okay, MPP order form. Okay, all this will be actually provided for you in the office, correct? But, okay, that being said, you can actually go to extranet. Okay, extranet is this thing, okay? Extranet is whereby we will give you a password a user ID after tonight, correct, whereby you can log on. Extranet is an online thing. That means all the information, all the slides that we share with you, all the latest update that we share with you is actually inside this thing. That means anytime you want to learn, you know, like anytime you, in the middle of the night, you want to learn, hey, uh, what's the update about this uh, company? What's the MoneyBuy program? Then you can go into this Extranet, use your username, your password, and then you log into it. Okay, inside there's a lot of information. Okay, there's a training, training manual, okay, MPP support. Okay, there's a lot, a lot of things, including the media policy whether you can set up, how you're gonna set up a website. You see, for me, myself, okay, I set up a website, correct? Okay? When I join this program, uh, I don't have a website for this MVP program. So I set up a website, I put uh, Google AdWords, correct? Right? I put Facebook, whatever, correct? Right? So I promote, correct? Right? Because if you don't promote, correct? Right? You know about this program, you don't promote, who will come to you, correct? Right? We'll come to this point later, correct? Right? So anyway, this extra net, okay, you have to spend time. Okay, some of them, I know, they don't spend time, go through this, this, this extra net, and then they start to ask their upline. 
whoever they're going to be a leader, they start to ask them all the questions that is actually included inside it. You see, when I first joined, I spent about one to two weeks reading all this PDF file, all this inside. Because there's a lot of information inside. Correct? One, two weeks because, you see, I'm the same as you. Correct? I have a full-time job outside. I'm not a full-time MPP. There's no full-time MPP one. Correct? MPP program is for part-time. Correct? MPP program is for freelance. You know, you have a full-time job outside, whatever. So this thing is when you want to have a passive income, add on to your business, add on to your, you know, whatever they are doing right now. Correct? Complement your, uh, you know, uh, supplement your income. Okay, this is a good platform. Correct? So you spend, spend time, okay, to read on this extra net, okay? So any question that you will ask, uh, this is how it look like in the uh, portal. Okay, so if you got any question, okay, you call your uh, partner manager, okay, you, by tomorrow you should know who is your partner manager. They will give you their mobile number, okay, their handphone, okay, you can call them. Correct? If you cannot get them, then you try to call this number, the MPP help desk, this number, 643-00251, okay? Same thing, no need to remember, it's in your extra net, okay? No need to remember, it's in your extra net, okay? This customer service number, correct, it's not for you to call one, okay? It's for your customer to call, that's why it's called customer service number, correct? But sometimes I myself call this number, why? Because I don't have upline one. That means I don't have my partner manager because I'm the partner manager. So when I got problem, I try to call help desk. But you see, look at the help desk at the time. It's 10 to 6 p.m., five days a week. If I got a question, my customer asked me a very complicated question on the weekend. Who I call? Correct? So I call the office, act like a customer. Or even I tell them through, I'm an MPP. So these customer service, they are well trained. They can actually tell you, okay, how to solve certain issue. Okay? Can? So they have 24 hours, seven days a week, so they can call. Okay? But uh, that being said, you must be patient. Okay? This number is not easy one. Correct? Okay, this number, uh, you call, sometimes you call, you will just like any hotline. Correct? It will take some time for them to pick up. Okay, so uh, you have to be patient. Uh. Okay, so we, how we sign up a customer? Okay, you know right now, this one gig, uh, just to share, this one gig will be increasing the price in the next one week. This is what I heard the latest. The next one week or two, we increase the price one gig for $49.99 to certain price. I don't know. So, okay, so how you're going to sign up is that you will have a boss system. Okay, this is the boss system. It's different from the extra net. Remember just now I show you the extra net? Extra net is whereby you go there and lock on and then print out all the form, learn everything, all the information. But boss system is whereby you go in and sign your customer. Okay, last time we used to have this manual thing. Okay, uh, wait uh. Okay, this manual, okay, this uh, use service application form whereby we fill up like that. Correct, right now I still do like that. Because you have to fill out all the application form, correct, including their name, data, everything. Then you will upload back to the boss system. Because the boss system is an online thing whereby you have to fill out everything, then you upload the page, correct? The page, okay, the application form in, onto it. This boss system, same thing, we're not gonna go through today, correct? Because it's same thing is in the extra net, step by step, step by step. Okay, on step six, you will know, learn how this, you're gonna upload back to the boss system. Okay, and uh, talking about manual service application form, how we do, is very simple, okay, I already explained to you. Okay, over here, you can see, all this is self-explanatory. The personal detail, you don't tell me you don't know how to fill out, right? Okay, the important thing in this thing is uh, you have to fill out the email address, correct, and the mobile number. Okay, because our bill, correct, our My Republic bill, they don't go by hard copy. That means they don't post to the customer one. They email to the customer. So that email has to be correct, correct? If not, the customer will never get the bill one. Then they will get cancellation, things like this. And then before that, to make appointment, they will usually call them. So the mobile number also has to be correct. Correct? You know, some people, they write the one and seven is the same. So you, as the MPP, you have to check this thing, okay? And then there's an ultra thing, okay? Ultra, Gamer Ultra, I think by now you should know the difference, right? Okay, Gamer, Gamer Ultra, okay? 12 month, 24 month, $58. All this will change, right? Okay, all this will change. The so one-time installation of $58 may change next week. $49.99 per month may change, okay? You have to look, go back to the extra net, okay? There's a product line, okay? Product line is whereby we update, the company update us as MPP, correct? Every two weeks or one month, okay, when they, whenever they got uh, changes, correct, they'll update us, then we go in and then we see what's the latest. Okay, if you're not sure, you know, some, some, some MPP ask me, correct, how will I know? I cannot be every night, go inside and log, see whether there's changes or not. That's where you have your partner manager, correct? Your partner manager, when there's ch uh, changes, they will tell you that, uh, who and who, okay, there's these changes, can you please take note, correct? So you will understand. And then this is the router. Okay, uh, then router you can choose. Okay, router, I think they did explain the router is not free one, huh? We give you $100 voucher, okay? This $100 voucher is for you to buy the router from our company, correct? It's not for you to go Challenger, go Simply Square, go and buy, can I one? Okay, if let's say you don't want to buy a router, this $100 can convert to cash or not? Can we? Oh, can I one? Okay, this $100, if you don't buy, it's void one, correct? So it's better to buy because the router is really on a discount, correct? Because like ASU AC56, okay, they are $300, $200, but they give you $100 discount, so it's actually cheaper if you buy from us. 
and then the payment mode. Okay, the payment mode is credit card, debit card, or Zyro. Okay, Zyro part later I explain. Zyro, okay, the okay, this part, okay. The, this is the form actually. They never see the form before, right? This is how the service application form is. Service application form, I explained is how you sign a customer. The top part, the second part, this is the last part. Okay, the channel ID, you look at the channel ID here, correct? This is the one for you to write out your channel ID. That means this year's the head office will not go to who? The commission. Correct? Just now you sign the form, right? That you go to the commission, right? So ask you to uh, write a bank account number. Correct? On every 15, on every 15, you will get a commission. Correct? On the previous month, up to 27. That means if let's say they install, okay, let's say they install on uh, June, correct, 27, and they pay before 27, then you'll get a commission on the 15. So this part you have to be careful, correct? If you forget what to write, okay, they will leave blank, they don't know who the sales go to. Okay? And then you need a photocopy IC, correct, of the of the customer. Correct, this is uh, our program director, later you'll get to see him. Okay. And then now we come to this important part, okay, Zyro. Okay, remember we only got three type of uh, three mode of payment. Uh, debit, credit, or Zyro. I always recommend people don't pay by Zyro. The reason is because Zyro is very, very troublesome. Okay, because Zyro, okay, you have to have an original copy. That means you cannot, you can upload. That just now I say the boss system, right? You scan, you upload to the boss system. You still need to bring this physical, this original copy back to the office. Correct? So what was the point? You get the same commission. And then there's delay because Zyro will take up to two months. Okay, up to two months, okay, to approve. And sometimes they may not approve because the signature may be a bit... Uh, you know different okay so try not to sign up zero okay debit card or credit card if I know not all, all, all of you got credit card correct so if they do a credit card they should have debit card because debit card works the same as zero to me only when your bank got money then you can deduct correct that's how debit card work it's the same thing as zero only when they got money then they can deduct uh. correct so now I ask you one very similar question correct if some customer insists say that I don't want to pay by debit card I don't buy a credit card I don't pay by zero how any any, any solution uh? Sorry? Cash and then use our own credit card. Oh, you, they, you collect cash from there and use your own credit card. This is one of my, one of the way one of my guys do, correct? But it's very troublesome. You can do that, correct? You can do that, correct? But it's very troublesome, but I have to trust that person. Why? Because your credit card could be written here. And then every month, my Republic will deduct your credit card. If the customer don't pay you on the second month, then they will still deduct, correct? And your commission later, my program director will share you, the commission is $70 to $100, correct? For the first two months, you still earn, correct? After third month, fourth month, it's, it's correct. So try not to do that. If they cannot, that's telling that there's no choice. Okay, if you want to sign up My Republic, one gig, correct? Now it's 490, maybe later part is 69, 89, I'm not sure, but it's still the cheapest. Because Starhub, correct, one gig as far as I know is $350 per month. Correct? Ours is 4990. It cannot be tomorrow up to 351. Maybe it's 8990 only, I think. Correct, it's still the cheapest. So if you want to sign up My Republic, uh Fire Probably, you tell them this is only our three mode of payment. If you cannot, then there's no choice, huh? then you don't sign up. It's like that one. You understand anything? Huh? Make things simple for yourself because you're not going to have one customer, you see. I joined this program about one and a half year ago, correct? About 200 over customers. If every customer, just like this gentleman said, is just correct, if he's my friend, I don't mind. Because I trust him, correct? If all my 200 customers don't pay by debit credit, I'm going to put my credit card on their form and then they're going to deduct from me. Very soon my credit card will go, you know, max out. So make it simple, must think long term, correct? You are just doing your job, okay? Just make it simple, debit, credit, or zero. Okay. And then zero, just one last thing. If they don't use, uh, they, they are not using signature in the bank, right? They use thumbprint, uh, worse. Correct? You gotta ask them, go to the bank, queue up, correct? To the bank teller, then in front of the bank teller, use the thumbprint chop. They will give you a verified true copy, and then they bring back and sign everything, then you can bring back. Correct? It's very, very troublesome on Zero, correct? Huh? For my 200 work case, I only got for about four or five Zero. Because those is really, really very old people. They don't trust debit card, they don't trust all these things, they, they prefer like that one. Okay? So fair enough. Okay? You still sign up. Okay? Zero, if there's one Zero, just let them be. But let's say if you, you know what? Uh, no, payment by check is only by SME, okay? Because we for fire problem, we also got SME customer. Only SME customer we accept check. Okay, for us, like I explained to you, just accept debit, credit, or zero, very simple one. Okay, so how you sign up with MyRepublic, okay? Like I explained to you, you have to know, okay, whether they're home pass or home reach, okay? Like I explained to you, home pass, how many appointments? Can somebody answer me? Uh? Home pass, how many appointments? Two, two. two appointments, correct? One appointment from OpenNet, second appointment from MyRepublic. Can MyRepublic go first or not? Can my Republic go install the modem, the router first? Cannot, right? Because the TP point have to go in first. Then, a few days later, my Republic will go and fix the modem, the router. Okay, it cannot be the other way around one. Okay? So sometimes, look at, I mean, nowadays, I share, you see, you're all MPP, you're signed a form, right? So we are all in the same, in the same boat. So I tell the truth. Okay, you know, nowadays, there's a lot of rumors that, wow, my Republic, uh, 
uh, cannot fulfill all these things. Actually, it's not our fault, frankly. I'm not trying to cite my public, correct? Remember, I don't work full time here. The truth is because OpenNet, if OpenNet stopped the first appointment, correct? It's supposed to be today, correct? That's last minute they call the customer, or they don't even call the customer, they don't come. So my public cannot come in and fix the Monet router because there's no TP point. You see, that is the main issue right now, correct? So it's not we're trying to push the blame to uh, OpenNet, but that is the truth as far as I know. Correct, so you must understand. So sometimes you explain to your customer. If they say, hey, I thought you said two appointment now, I take leave already. Then why the appointment cancel? Okay, most likely 99% is because open net cancel the appointment. So we cannot come in, okay? So after that, the order team, after you submit the form, just now upload to the box system. The order team, which is just now the lady outside, Adeline, right? you saw a lady there, sitting down there, Adeline. Okay, she's the order team. She will give you, a, uh, she will use the office for give your customer SMS. Correct, SMS, okay, they tell them where are they, as they already receive your application form, okay, that means to acknowledge. You know why? Because customer will feel scared. Okay, the form itself got the you gotta take the IC front and back for the set, remember? They're gonna give you the debit card credit card. Correct? It's all the sensitive uh, uh, information. And then after that you disappear for a few days or even weeks without notice, and then they were scared they will report police. Correct? So our office come out with this system whereby they will automatically SMS the customer that yes, my public headquarter already received your form already. So they feel assured. You understand? You understand what I'm trying to say? Okay. So if the TP is not uh, installed, correct? Okay. Open and come in within three weeks. This is, this is take it with a pinch of salt. It's three weeks or it can be three months. Uh, so you don't overpromise. I always don't overpromise. Now I sign up for a broadband. I always tell my customer, can you wait two months up to three months or not? If you can wait, uh, then you sign up. If you cannot, then you better don't because open air issue. This one gig uh, is different. Like last time, 100 Mbps, 200 Mbps. One gig is the fastest in Singapore. So, and it's a cheaper somehow. So for those people that want one gig at this price, they must wait, correct? Good thing comes to people that wait, correct? If they cannot wait, then it's okay. Don't, don't let them feel a loss you, okay? So, and uh, let's say after open air fix already, my Republic can't fix the ONT, which is the, remember the box, the modem, and the Wi-Fi router, okay? Now another question, correct? If just now they never upgrade, they never buy the router, correct? How? How are they gonna fix this thing? That means the customer, when they sign up the form that time, correct? They only sign up our ultra plan, correct? One gig. And then they never use, they never redeem the hundred dollar voucher, correct? So when installation come with it, my public installer come, they fix the ONT, then no router. How? Can they still serve the internet? Can? can. Who say can? Why? Ah, you see? Okay. Wi-Fi, correct? Router, correct? Router. Okay. There is people that say can, and people say cannot. This is more technical. To me, I think this LAN cable, correct? LAN cable, I think we can link to the computer, you know, directly, correct? Router, Wi-Fi router is for wireless. That means my laptop is here right now, correct? My router put there. So is it wireless? But without router, I can still use it if I have a cable that link to the OND, correct? But you know, nowadays people don't know like that. They like wireless, okay? But this is a technical question. Slowly you will understand more, okay? And just to let you understand, before I join this, okay, I never have any, I don't understand what's fiber band. But after one, two months, like I explained to you, slowly you will know it's all very simple one, okay? So now the next step, okay, I hate to do this uh, because I think it's very insurance time, correct? You take out your phone, you know, then after that, everybody go to your phone book or get to see three friends, correct? But you have to do this, correct? You don't have to do it right now, but when you go back home today, you must understand, okay? If after, after this session, you spend from seven o'clock until later, maybe nine something, 10 o'clock, correct? And then you, after this training session, you go back home and you do nothing, I can tell you nothing will happen one. You will feel that you're wasting your, your time here, really, okay? So how I start and how all my guys start, right? okay? In this we start with the warm market. It's very insurance style, I told you, but there's no choice. Why insurance, all insurance agents from last night, 20 years ago, and still do the same thing? Because it works, correct? Because for one market, people trust you. Like, let's say he's my friend, correct? Let's tell you, hey, I'm not joined my Republic already, correct? Okay, you want to sign up for you can find me. Like that only one, correct? It's just a simple message, a simple call, a simple talk, correct? So they may ask you a question, you see? The advantage of uh, approaching your warm market, you know, your friend, relative, colleagues, last night, army, buddy, whatever, is because you can make a mistake. If you make a mistake, you say wrongly, right, they won't, the most they laugh will be, uh, you don't know what you're talking eh. But then you faster go back and survey, wait, 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 go to look, look through the external again. You see? But you're gonna pitch your cold market, that means people that you don't know one. You go do door to door, all these things, you do road show, people that don't know, you cannot make mistake, eh, correct? If you make mistake, then you, they sign it, eh, and then they believe what you say, then they submit the form, after that come back, it's a different thing. You see one gig, what is it? It's it's probably like that kind of thing, correct? It becomes very, very dangerous. So I always tell people, okay, go back home today, okay, list as many, People in your phone book, okay, whatever you think that they need fiber band one. Who don't have internet at home now? I think everybody have internet. It's, it's as good as like a television, as a, a laptop. Everybody have one. Internet broadband, why I do this business? Because internet fiber band is a very basic thing. Correct? It's a very basic thing. Everybody have one. Even now, today, if you are with Sintel, N1 Starhub, I think the contract will end soon, right? 
Why? Because it's only 24 months. Right? Correct? Very soon, your friend or relative, their contract will end. And then you keep telling them that you're from my public. You put your Facebook, you're telling them my public. And then you are, don't know that you are right now sitting at a gold mine because, uh, you know, I think news already come out already. Correct? My public is going to be, most likely, you're going to call me, it's going to be the fourth Delco. Correct? We're going to sell the 4G unlimited data plan. Correct? Today, you join here, is at the right time. Why? Because, yes, today you're selling fiber broadband. Correct? But once we get a license, correct? Once you come with a product that the 4G unlimited data plan, Imagine how many people from Sinti Island start will jump over. Oh, you're from my Republic, uh, then they all come. Imagine how much commission you earn by then. You understand what I'm trying to say? So don't look this program so small, like, oh, I only sell fiber broadband because one house only need one fiber broadband. Correct? Yes, one house need one fiber broadband, but one house got a lot of mobile phone. Correct? If you've got five people, you know, they have more than at least five mobile phones because like, some of them they got two mobile phones. Okay? So, and then you check, okay, after that you check, the, uh, I explain to you, okay, whether your friend or relative, whether when's the contract finish, then just keep there updated of the latest price, then check whether the home reach, home pass, and then after that you sign up with my Republic, okay? So don't worry, okay, if today, okay, I'm not trying to pitch to you, but today if you think that my Republic one gig, like I explained to you, they're gonna increase the price one week later. You think that you wanna sign up today, correct? You can later go out, out there and tell them that you wanna sign up as a my Republic customer. Okay, what we'll give you is that we'll give you a free study IP. Those that don't know what is study IP, that means you don't need. Understand? Uh? It's study one. Uh, one free study IP is worth $50, correct? Or one home voice free. That, this is only available if you are My Republic MPP and you sign up tonight. Okay, after tonight, only, you don't go out and call your online whoever, hey, I want this one, no more already. Okay, this one is only for tonight, only, okay? And we don't earn commission from this one, frankly. This commission go to who? If you sign up today. I tell you, frankly, this commission go back to yourself. Because you are MPP already, remember? You are already part of us. So you sign the form, the channel ID you write yourself, your own ID. That means the commission is a kind of rebate. You earn your seventy to hundred dollar back. Correct. You pay forty nine ninety to subscription one month. You earn back seventy to hundred dollar. Correct. So it's, it's a good deal. Okay. Those that want later can just go out there. Okay. Okay. So any question? Any question before I pass to the program director?